I'm here. I'm here at the end salon asking for a refund because I got a terrible haircut. You know, this guy seems like kind of a douche. I'm not gonna lie. You know, he just got a haircut from these people. He's probably been sitting in the chair making small talk with them for about 15 minutes, and now he's being a dick and he's coming back and asking them for his money. But this other lady is a customer and she has absolutely nothing to do with it, so I don't understand the confrontation at all. Oh, you're and this is, is a disgusting. customer. My language, your I'm language a, is disgusting. I'm a customer I'm asking... and you have offended me. This lady's outburst might seem a little bit funny to you, but in reality, this is a look into the future because now we have a system of government that's in place that puts people's right not to get offended ahead of people's right to freely vocalize themselves. So this lady actually does have a point that's recognized by the public nowadays. She even says in the beginning of the video that she has a law degree. That means that this is an individual who's fairly well educated on her legal matters. I I'm, I'm not talking to you. Of me. I, I'm not Stop on you. Hitting me. Wow, that's crazy. You know, she's just making these blanket ac accusations. I mean, from the video, I didn't see him hit her at all. And going by that, I can't even imagine. I mean, think about it. People in this world would probably see this situation and immediately blame the guy. So it's pretty disturbing. I'm hitting Get you. Out of here. Get out of this. Look at this. Look at this. You get out of this. My show. arms are. Look, dude. Get this lady is legit body slamming this dude and you know his hair doesn't look that bad I, I don't think that he deserves to get his money back for that haircut if she if she doesn't get her she's grabbing me dude where has the human race gone no no i'm not talking to you so if you didn't notice what happened just there, it looks like she just bumped into him again and then went immediately to screaming to make it look like the physical contact that they engaged in was in fact something that she could get into a fuss about and try to get people to rally behind her cause and just because she's got some personal gripe with this dude. I'm not talking to you! This whole thing is being recorded! Ah! Alright, I'm calling the cops. Ah! I'm calling- look, look at this lady! Yeah, this dude should have called the cops before the situation escalated. This whole thing's being recorded, you psychopath! Jesus yeah. Christ! Go sit the fuck down, my you rib. nutcase! My rib! Bro. Your rib! Good, your rib! You land, you slammed into me! My hands your are up in the air! I haven't said one bad word! The F word? You've been <laughs> screaming since you walked in? Hey, all I said is I want a fucking refund if you're not gonna give me- there, thank you. Now, honestly, after watching the whole video, I'm sort of rooting for the old lady on this one. I mean, granted, she's a crazy bitch, but, I mean, this dude wa gets his hair cut at, an, at a salon for old ladies, for one, and then after he's not happy with the haircut that he got, which was clearly designed for an old person and not, you know, the tattooed youngin that he considers himself to be, he gets pissed off and comes back in the store and, you know, he starts screaming screaming the fuck at everybody and, you know, just generally being a douche, and then this lady, you know, gets up and sticks up for everybody. I mean, you know, maybe she went about it the wrong way, but at the end of the day, I'm gonna have to sign with her just because fuck this dude.